uh, actually you get paid to draw for a living. <laughs> yeah. The skill that I learned in kindergarten is to use my creativity to my advantage, which really helps out in my job, which is I go out on the road and I tour with uh, different shows, whether it be theater, or rock concerts, or anything like that. Being super creative helps out when I go to different theaters or spaces to uh, make my job a lot easier. The importance of taking a nap when other people tell you you need one. I learned how to play and how to imagine, how to combine the imagination with playing and uh, imagining a better world, a better place is something I still do today and playing, that's really important too. Basically, how to play nice and share with others. Collaboration wins more than competition. <laughs> yeah, so in kindergarten I learned how to speak French, so bonjour, je m'appelle Zach. Um, that's really basic, but I learned more than that. But um, it actually continued all throughout uh, elementary and high school because I continued in French uh, completely and I still use it at work today, so. When someone says they're going to throw up, get out of their way. You know, the first thing I remember about kindergarten was that my mother was there. She was my teacher, and I couldn't understand what all those other kids were doing there in our new house. Of course, it wasn't a new house. It was my first school. And when I realized what was going on, I learned the great joy of kindergarten. I was surrounded by kids just like me, kids who were fascinated to learn, kids who were excited to be together to do the learning. And that is what I think I remember most being in a big, happy family, experiencing school together. Sometimes we weren't very happy. Sometimes some kids got upset. But most of the time, kids laughed and they smiled and they helped each other. In a way, it was like a whole new family. We started school together, we had fun together, and we all became great friends. I'd say in kindergarten I learned a lot of people skills, a lot of learning about how mean people can be, but also how nice people can be, like sharing is caring kind of stuff. Um, I don't remember anything specifically like curriculum related from kindergarten, but just a lot of like learning how to deal with other people. I learned two, two. Uh, alphabets and smile. They work all the time. <laughs> I think as I think back, and it is a long time ago, um, I think that was really my first opportunity to start feeling some independence and learning independence, uh, self-sufficiency. Uh, mom wasn't in the classroom, my older sister wasn't in the classroom, I was just there uh, with the teachers, so you had to sort of learn to adapt to that environment, you had to learn how that environment worked, but you were on your own there. Um, you had to learn how to deal with people, and how to interact with them, so that whole thing about relationships which has been so important. I think that was a really early start because you're in a group of uh, strangers and you know you're doing all sorts of things like you know creative things and fun things and play things but you're learning a lot of that and doing it on your own so I think I always think of uh, my first uh, feeling of independence. Okay I learned how to speak, I learned how to dress up properly, I learned how to sleep sleep properly because they would force sleep me <laughs> in the midday for no reason I didn't understand that I um, my coloring skills I said tie your shoes my friend said reading but both of them Wow. Uh, okay skills I would have to say I learned communication I learned team skills I learned basically how to adapt to the environment Hello, my name is Pooja Honda. I'm a host of CP24 Breakfast and a CP24 anchor. And the skill that I learned in senior kindergarten that serves me well today would definitely have to be nap time, right? Am I right or am I right? You know, you know those kids who just had a complete meltdown, they got all cranky. I know a few of those people today. I'm one of them. I need my nap, it's important. Uh, no, seriously, uh, the skill that I learned is probably the golden rule, which essentially is treat others the way you would like to be treated. Uh, it's amazing how far a little kindness can go in terms of gaining and earning the respect of your peers.